The government has defended the National Judicial Appointment Commission before the Supreme Court with the Attorney General Mukul Rohodgi saying it doesn't affect the basic structure of constitution as alleged by the petitioners. He said that on the contrary, the National Judicial Appointment Commission is in sync with the need of times and is modelled with checks and balances and a democratic process with plurality of views. He also argued that in fact the National Judicial Appointment Commission has diluted the power of the executive as six out of three members of the National Judicial Appointment Commission are Supreme Court judges and the Chief Justice of India is its chairman. The Apex Court asked the Centre whether any decision of the President regarding appointment of judges under Article 124 with the consultation of the Chief Justice of India was his discretionary decision or based on aid and advice of the government. The court was hearing a batch of petitions including the plea filed by the Supreme Court Advocates on Record Association against the National Judicial Appointment Commission. Senior Advocate F.S. Nariman appearing for Supreme Court Advocates on Record Association had sought a stay on the operation of the National Judicial Appointment Commission on the ground that in any case the new system was not functioning as the Chief Justice of India has not been participating in it. Vikas Sarthi's report, Doordarshan News.